Look what I'm trying out for Mass Monday today. Let's see how it works. Stay tuned. <music> Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hey, my name is Michelle. Very nice to meet you. And if you guys are coming back, hey, what's up? So today I'm going to be doing a Mass Monday. Happy Mass Monday. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> so I'm going to be using, this is the Ses Moy, I don't know, um, Smoothing Aloe. Well, you know me, you guys, I can't see. Let's go put on these glasses. So it's a cucumber and aloe gel facial mask. And it is supposed to be very hydrating. It has a unique combination of organic aloe, cucumber, and caladilla to help soothe and hydrate the skin. So that is what the package looks like. This is the back of the container. Okay, I'm like, I'm going crooked, you guys. <laughs> and there is the front of it. So I got this in, I don't know what box. <coughs> Sorry. Very bad allergies. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on and I'll read some of the reviews from it. So this is the container here. Now, I did look this up online, and I'm getting prices from, like, Target and a couple of other places that you could find this, and it looks like it's not very expensive. We're looking at uh, $10. We're looking at, uh, even on eBay, it's $4, but at Target and Walmart, Target has it for $11.89. Walmart has it for $14.85. Um, so, um, Macari has it for $5, so it's not a very expensive, um, product. So, I'm going to go ahead. I don't have my little, I washed all my brushes, you guys. So, all you're going to do, it looks like aloe, essentially. And I'm going to put it on my skin. And my face is washed, but... I've had, my skin has been so dry lately, and I need to go ahead and rehydrate my skin, and I think it's just like, our weather here in Texas has been hot, cold, hot, cold, hot, cold, and I think my skin is just not loving it, so I've been uh, having dry patches. And little breakouts, so I need to start um, changing up my skin products that I had out for the summertime, which now I need more of the overnight hydrating um, products versus the serums and stuff, which I had kind of like put it away during the summertime, but... Now with this weather, you know, hot, cold, hot, cold, it is just making my skin not know what the heck to do. So, I think I have to change my skin care routine. And if you guys like me to do a video on that and some of the products that I use, I will go ahead and do that just leave me a comment down below in the comment section and say hey I would love to see your skincare routine and I will go ahead and show it to you guys all right I think I have enough on my face <laughs> let's get to some of the reviews awesome I hope everybody had a merry merry Christmas uh, mine was uh, I was Happy that it was over with, uh, but sad at the same time. Um, 
it. I get to relax now. I go back to work on Wednesday only this week, and then I'm off again until the following week. So I am just happy to have these days off just to relax and calm down and just to put some of this, especially my son, he had so many uh, gifts. If you guys haven't watched my last day of my vlogmas, I put it up late yesterday, so go ahead and check that out. I still also have to do my collab. Uh, I have to apologize to the young ladies that I'm in the collab with. I had really bad issues with my computer, and so if you guys still want me to put up the video, I will go ahead for the New Year's Eve look. New Year's is not here yet, so I have enough time, but I do apologize. My computer just, I think with everybody that was in the house and like my niece was um, using my password for the internet, my parents had their computers. Um, <clears throat> I think my, our system just went crazy yesterday. And as you guys, if you guys don't know, I always have problems with my computer, so. It's just like, oh my gosh, so. But I'm hoping you guys had a great day. Uh, New Year's is coming. Is anybody doing anything special for New Year's? Um, I probably will do a live stream. I'm not going very much anyway. I have a young child, so don't really do very much. I'm not big of a drinker, but I will always have one little glass is something just for that day. Maybe I'll have wine or something like that, but I won't be doing anything major. When he gets a little bit older, we might go downtown here in uh, San Antonio. They have things going on, but it gets a little crazy. He's only nine, and I just don't want to have to be sitting there having to be like, oh no, you did not push me, did you? So <laughs> I said I'll stay away from it. <laughs> One year, I'll probably have, like, a a party here. So, I'm looking at one website which had 30 reviews on this product. Uh, 14 of them were 5 star. Uh, 11 of them were 4 stars. Then you have one for 3 stars, one for 2 stars, and 3 for 1 star. So, <laughs> let me go ahead and look at some of these reviews. Um... One of them is as part of a promotion. Uh, so when I was putting this mask on, it felt like I was putting aloe vera on my face, which I said that so too. It absorbed in my skin very quickly. I honestly wasn't really expecting anything to happen, but my face looked great afterwards. Well hydrated, reduce redness. Okay. Um, this person said, didn't use. I don't use wash off masks because they are too drying. Okay, that was her only review, so she never really tried the product. Uh, this one, so when I was putting this mask on, uh, oh, sounds like it was the same one. Uh, it's um, right off the bat, I'm really enjoying this mask. It's very soothing. It does actually feel cooling on the skin, which is great for me because my skin is prone to irritation and hives, and this is doing a great job to diminish that and decrease some of the redness and irritation I've been going that had been going on. All right, this one says very smoothing and hydrating. I feel like my face just got a beautiful, refreshing bath. This is my first time using any Cest Moy uh, products, and I'm very pleased. Uh, I appreciate for that that is clean product and it worked well on my sensitive skin. Great price uh, for results produced. Uh, helps to ease burning and drying my skin. I recommend keeping this mess uh, products in the refrigerator before using as a cooling provides even up. Oh, I might have to try it in the refrigerator. So pretty decent for the price, very soothing. So I'm trying to get to any of the bad ones. This one says, meh, does it do anything? What is the purpose? It was nice to try, but I didn't feel like this did anything. The mask should do something in the 15, 30 minutes it sits in your skin. Skin, I didn't feel moisturized or smoother or more radiant, just nothing. Wow. I like to look at the bad ones because, you know, 
you're putting this. Everybody wants to look at the good ones, but I want to see some of the bad reviews. Uh, and just kind of like have it, um, you know, see what my friend has not tried it yet, so I cannot leave a review. This one didn't use. So, I mean, the ones that only have one star or something, they didn't really say very much on it. So, I mean, I'm going to try a different site. Oh, Target has 3,458 reviews on this. And they have this one, the 1.7 fluid ounce, and I believe it was $11 on their site. I'm just waiting for it to come on. I want to see the reviews. Oh, no, it only has 14 reviews. How come it said it had all of those reviews on it? That's kind of weird. Oh, they have different ones, which I didn't know. They have, um, this brand itself has refreshing, uh, pure, so they have different types. They have a purifying one, which is charcoal, uh, clay mask, and that one is eleven eighty nine. so right there. Oops. How come I can't do everything straight today? So, they have different types of mask they had the smoothing a cucumber they had a clarify one uh the soothing cucumber is 11.89 the clay one is 11.89 they also have a clarify one which is 14.19 and they have a blemish treatment pads for 15.39 not bad so they have a few different type of um products in this brand so so we will see how this works. Uh, reviews. I mean, I'm looking at the reviews. Not really bad ones. Um, has a great product to smooth the irritated skin. Um, does it do anything? What is the purpose? Uh, ch -ch -ch those are kind of like, but everything that I've seen, and these are from eight, nine months uh, a year ago, because it's not a new product. Um, this one says, I love this brand and the ladies behind it, but I got a sample of this mask from Beautycon, and I tried it this morning, and in less than a minute, I noticed a tingling and a swelling sensation on my face and from my ribs. Right there, off immediately, and noticed the same sensation on other parts of my face. So I wiped it all off. It smells nice and feels good to put on because it's a clear aloe gel, but for some reason, my skin reacted to it. So she had a reaction. I wouldn't say this is smoothing by any means. I don't have sensitive skin, and this is done. Felt it's a mask that does nothing. Okay. <coughs> I haven't noticed any stinging. I haven't noticed any... Um, anything off of it. Uh, I wouldn't say I'm feeling any cooling sensation. I mean, it really has absorbed into my skin. I mean, I still feel it tacky. So I'm not feeling very much of anything. Um, I still feel that it's there because it's, see, tacky on my skin. But, um... My skin is relatively, I mean, it's not totally dry, but I can feel that it's there. Um, I'll probably take it off in about another minute. Um, but uh, has anybody tried this mask? To me, um, hopefully it hydrates my face. I'm probably going to put a bunch of, because uh, I'm not really going anywhere today. Um, I'm probably going to go ahead and just uh, put on a whole bunch of, thick serums and thick, you know, moisturizing creams and stuff on my face. Try to rehydrate my face this whole week. I won't be putting any, um, do a lot of makeup on. I'll probably be doing some videos for you guys, but after that, I will take everything off and then, you know, just keep moisturizing my skin just to bring back some of that 
niceness because I've had some, if you see right over here, little patches and little breakouts right over here. And it's really weird because it's not really big breakouts. It's just like dry patches, which is really weird. So I need to step up on my uh, skincare routine again. And again, if you guys want to see my skincare routine or the products that I use, definitely go ahead and comment down below. And I'll do a video for that, at least of what I use. Now, everybody, what works on one person doesn't work on another person. Everybody has different types of skin. Um, some are more sensitive, some are not sensitive. My skin is not very sensitive, but some things will go ahead and irritate it. Uh, like clay masks seem to irritate my skin a lot. It brings out anything from below up above, you know, to the surface. And so then my skin reacts a little crazy with it. So I try to stay away from clay masks personally. Uh, but some people love clay masks. So me personally, it just seems to irritate my skin. And not in like a bad way. Like it just brings everything from deep down inside and it just grabs it and pulls it out. <laughs> so I don't, I stay away from them. So, um, uh, another couple of things, you guys, I, I've gotten over my thousand subscribers, so I appreciate it so much. Uh, it is all in part for everybody that's watching this video. You guys are amazing. Uh, thank you so much. I just am like, just amazed still. So much has happened right before Christmas and I haven't had a time to absorb everything because it's just like boom, 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 let's do this. And so in the middle of 25 days of Vlogmas and then getting monetized and reaching my thousand subscribers and Christmas coming and now having to put everything away, it's just like, whoa, my mind went pew. <laughs> so I want to thank everybody from the bottom of my heart, I am like so amazed that I got here and I wouldn't have gotten here without you guys. So I appreciate it so much from you guys. Uh, I will be having a monetization party coming up next Saturday, which is on January 1st. So make sure you hit that notification bell so you know whenever uh, I post that video. Uh, it will be a live stream. Uh, also, I will be doing a thousand subscriber giveaway. Uh, I'm working on getting a couple of more products in. I do have the Bloodlust palette and some more uh, Jeffree Star lippies. That will be one prize. I do have... Um, <coughs> sorry, everybody. Very bad allergies. I do think I'm going to do a skincare um, prize. I might do a other makeup kind of uh, prize. And I might either have uh, two gift cards. So, so it might either be four or it might be five. I might just do the skincare, the um, Jeffree Star, and then two gift cards. Or I might add another prize in it. I'm just gathering everything around. So it'll take me a few days, especially with the holidays right now. I can't ship anything out just because this mom is broke. So, <laughs> but I am uh, gathering stuff up. I'm looking through everything that I have here and to see what else I need to go ahead and buy for you guys. Um, and then this way I will have a 1,000 subscriber uh, giveaway. So I'm very excited about that. And like I said, without you guys, I would not have been able to do this. So I appreciate it. I love you guys so much. Um, let me go ahead and take this off and I'll show you what my skin looks like in a moment. So don't go away. Okay, I'm back. I washed it off. Um, okay. My honest opinion on this uh, it did, when I put the water on my face to wash everything off, I did feel that cooling effect that one uh, time. Um, but I have to agree. Um, meh. <laughs> Just like that girl says, meh. Uh, I, I don't... Um, My skin doesn't 
feel like it's hydrated. It doesn't feel like it's dry. Um, I mean, I can't say that it didn't do anything, but um, I don't feel super moisturized. And I don't know if it's that because of the fact also, like it's, I told everybody, my skin has been very, very dry having those little dry patches going on. These are all like dry patches beside my, you know, Malaysia that I have there and over here and over here. Um, but, um, I would say if you don't have super dry skin, you might get a little bit more moisturizing effect from this. Uh, like I said, when I put on the water on my face, I did have a cooling sensation on my face. So I did like that part. It doesn't really have very much of a smell to it, but I mean, I mean, my face feels a little softer than it did before, but nothing major. Um, I would say for the price that you could get this, um, go ahead and try it because it might work better on you than it does on me. I'm looking for something that's going to go ahead and just make my face go soggy and, you know, <laughs> moisturize the the heck out of my face so that's what I'm looking for so but would I say that it hasn't broken me out I have no red spots uh, it didn't dry out my skin which I do like that um, will I try it again and see on another day after I moisturize my face a little bit more I think I might go back to this one other time for you guys uh, and just give it more of a fair shot when my face is not as dry as what it is right now just because of the weather and stuff like that. And then I might try it one more time for you guys um, just to give it a fair assessment. I mean, right now for the way that my skin is where it's very, very dry, it did a little something, but nothing that I'm going to go out and say, oh my gosh, you have to buy this product. Um, I've done that on a couple of other different one of my NAS. This one, uh, if you can find it on Mercari and stuff for the $5, or if it's somebody's, you know, has a mystery bag or something like that, and it's in there, hey, it's worth a shot. But would I, would I personally right now at this moment go out and spend $11.89 or $14 on this product at this very moment? No. Um, again, I'm going to go ahead and moisturize and do my face a couple of times and I will go ahead after I get my skin a little bit more hydrated from whatever it's doing right now. I'll, I'll try it one more time and then we view, we review this product just to be, give it a fair shot because I don't want to say, oh, it's terrible and you can't, you know, don't ever get it. I think if your face is not as dry as mine right now at this moment, it might do a little bit more for you than what it did for me. So, but I don't know. You guys tell me down below, have you guys used it? Have you noticed any difference with this product? Um, let me know. Also, if you guys want to see my skincare regimen that I'm going to be doing for my drier skin, uh, right now to just kind of like heal it a little bit better then definitely go down below go ahead and leave me a comment and I will probably uh, do part of it here and um, I could do mostly all of it here because I probably will be using more exfoliators again uh, and then going ahead and doing my nighttime routine and I could do my daytime routine so let me know, you guys, if you want to go ahead and see that. And I might just go ahead and do that anyway. So this way, um, especially with the seasons changing, something that I do might help somebody. But again, our skins are all different. I'm just rambling, you guys. So let me let you guys go. 
uh, I will see you guys on my next video, which I should be uploading a few more eye looks on the channel for this month. I'm also going to put a poll out, you guys. I am changing things with my boxes, and I want your guys' opinion on what you think I should do. I'm either going to go ahead and get four different types of boxes, meaning four different categories. Lifestyle, candles, um, uh, holistic, uh, food, um, you know, different types of categories. And I'm thinking about getting those boxes and doing them for either three months and then reviewing them at the end. And then I will change it to four different boxes and I will be doing those for three months. Or I could do those four different types of categories for two months and then go ahead and change them to another four different boxes so this way it gives you guys more looks into different boxes that they are out there and I'm going to be getting wide ranges of different boxes they have socks they have underwears they have bras they have uh, pickles they have uh, stuff from Japan they have vegan they have I mean stationery. there's so many boxes out there you guys and I want to show you guys a little bit of them so also somebody suggested that I might do uh, four of the same type of boxes for two months uh, or I could do four of the same type of boxes for three months and then review them at the end and then switch over to four different type of products. So I could do either four uh, household products or household lifestyle boxes and then after three months review them and then switch over to maybe four candle or scent kind of ones and then so on and so on. So you guys go ahead and make sure you take that poll and let me know what you guys think. Um, I'm going to highly consider the one that gets more votes but I still am playing around with the idea so for this month I canceled a lot of my boxes um, and so I'm gonna revamp all my boxes again to give everybody a chance to see different types of boxes um, from indie brands to below to a little bit higher up which I will switch over to those in the after the first three months uh, and so We'll see how that works. So make sure you hit that subscribe button somewhere down there because it is free. I would appreciate it. Give me a thumbs up because I always love that. And that notification bell, that little ringy ding ding, make sure you guys hit that so you never miss uh, any new videos that I upload and we can continue having fun here. So have a wonderful, fabulous day, you guys. Stay safe out there and I will see you on my next video. Bye.